It's time for 1,000 pound sisters. And the last one, Tammy gained some weight. And uh, nothing else at all has changed. That's literally the entire last episode. And Chris brought her a whole buffet of barbecue and uh, surprise. Yeah. Eight pounds of food. There it is. There the, the, the 583.9. 583.9. How do you feel about that? I'm confused. I just weighed in. And again, 10 oh, there goes the freaking god dang chop, <laughs> chopping up with a chainsaw again. I uh, just gained two pounds. <laughs> I'm sure she just said that just all together. Show? It's just this show they do. Yeah, they they like do that. a Night Day Fiance too, but it's really bad on this one. I don't know if because they speak slow. She's like, I just gained 10 pounds, you know, set like that, and they just chopped it up. But it always sounds, it, uh, what did I compare it to one time? The South Park episode where the chef, the guy who played chef, like quit and they, make fun of him or whatever and they just chopped up all this audio that they have it was the first time i gained weight since before i got in the hospital i don't understand why i've been putting in weight it's a it's a medical mystery we'll never understand but i mean we keep talking about that order the, like we, what do you want to eat you want lasagna you want hot dogs you want all this stuff that's you know no like healthy options really and they talk about people right. going out and sneaking out and getting fast food chris showed up with you know five stacks of things are apparently full of barbecue. I guess it was supposed to be for everyone. They all sat down to talk and Tammy was literally the only one eating. As, and I don't, I don't know, man. I don't know if this is fabricated because like this season is supposed to be the wholesome one and they just kind of need like a little bit of drama there because nothing's going on right now. Yeah. yeah it's kind of what it, it's kind of what I'm feeling right now. I'm so ready to go home, but I still have to make it down to 550 to be approved for bariatric surgery. 550 is what she's trying to get to. Yeah, and all of a sudden, right here at the very end, she like gained a little weight. Hmm, right. X to doubt. Okay, so you hit a little bit of a plateau. A plateau? What? <laughs> I mean, maybe I'm just uneducated in this, but like hitting the plateau when you still weigh over, when you still weigh that much? I don't know about that. All right. Yeah, I don't either. I'm sure there's going to be like, someone in the comments there, there had to learning have been me just right a now. Time period of just poor eating choices. Yeah, for it's a like, certain extended time, you know, like how is she confused? It's like you you reach plateaus for sure. Like whenever you we like you are trying to lose, I don't know. You're already pretty small, but you want to lose like a little bit more. It's a lot harder to do, right? When you're this big, I've never heard of it being like actually difficult to like get. Past. But anyway, whatever. Uh, like I said, I'm sure there's someone in the comments right now. Be like, aha! But can I? weighed 500 pounds and I had a plateau and I'll be like, oh, my bad, sorry. Just wanna get smaller. And that'll take time and you're getting there. So, and, and I guess the reason why I'm like kind of critical about this whole topic of her gaining weight, if, if it's true or not, is because she's in rehab, right? Right, to lose weight. Yeah, to lose weight. She's in a rehab facility for that. If anyone goes there and gains weight, there's an issue. <laughs> There's a problem. Something's happening. <laughs> something is happening that should not be happening here. It's weird to me. It's, it's very. It's a, it's a big red flag of something that I'm just not understanding of like how it's even actually allowed or possible to to gain right. weight while you're here. Does she got like a friend nurse who's going to get it for her or something? Yeah, yeah. Like the, the meals they they bring to her should all be it should be like calorie counted out and like on a you know to keep her losing. So yeah. Anyway, it just. Doesn't make any sense. My aide, Kimberly, tried to comfort me and tell me that many people plateau when they're losing weight. She looks, she's looking pretty happy that they're backing out of here. I, I figure like old Tammy would, would have been like really crushed by this. If she's trying so hard and gained weight. I guess just get over it. I'm, I'm just very skeptical if like it's even real because <laughs> it doesn't seem like anyone is. Yeah, it does, like, this, this should be like a serious like what? But it's not for some reason. Yeah. That's a lot of plates, dude. Why do they have so many plates? That is a lot of plates. Holy crap, dude. This is, there's. Are those papers? G like the, no, the, the, I, maybe those, there's, that's a lot, a lot of plates, plates yeah. up here. Good Lord, man. There's plates over here. It's not even the only stack. You want to come help me for something? <laughs> what are you oh, doing? there he is. All right, they got him coming out. They got to get him with his shirt off. All right, all right. It's been a year since my surgery. And later on today, 
I have a check in with Dr. Smith. Very nice. He just wants to see where I'm at. Very, very long. That's a lot of weight loss, Chris. You're looking good. Keep it up, buddy. Well, I'm hoping I get the okay for me to get the skin removal because I no longer look like a pumpkin. I kind of look like a dried up, shriveled prune. <laughs> skin removal surgery. Man, I hear that's very painful. It's very, there's a lot of, a lot of drainage, like, like, like tubes to you and everything because like you're so much fluid. Your right. body trying to recover? Yeah, jeez. I really need to see what my waist sign would be if they cut all this extra jelly row off. So I'm trying to just get a, an accurate measurement under my row. Why? Why, why? why do I ask these questions? It's because the camera's here. Okay, <sighs> Ken, pretend, <laughs> right. pretend this, these are not stage scenarios. Ah, been watching too much reality TV, man. It says 46. 46? It was pushing 66. Dang! 66 to 46. 66? Golly. Wow. That's pretty good in a year. Is that under the roll? Under my roll. Golly. In the last few months, my self-confidence has went down because of all this extra skin. Oh, Chris. He's like, God dang, the, the, the loose skin's getting to him now. He's like, lost the weight, but now he's like, God dang it, now this is here. When does it end? Mm -hmm. Then if you get surgery, then you got the scars. <sighs> yeah. Mississippi mud. <laughs> he got the Mississippi mud what? back there. There it is. Man, <laughs> Yeah, the old Mississippi mud. The old old beard. It was famous. Old black and tan. Look at that alligator on there. So that's a Louisiana huh. thing. Yeah. Unless you go down to the Delta, I guess. And then you got to worry about all the crakes and the crevices and the felt jelly rolls and. It's just a whole lot of work. No, but they didn't have any. They didn't have any subtitles on them. They started talking. He got a little too country for him. They had to <laughs> get it out there. Get all this flying squirrel syndrome taken care of. You're not a flying squirrel. The hell! I could jump off a building and glide to the next state. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow! He just realized he's he can become a superhero. He's gonna save us all. Flying squirrel man. Oh, my man is out here struggling, blowing up that whole oh. thing. But the justice, oh, he's going to pass out. <laughs> he's going to be out uh, there for the next hour. God. There's dead Jack. Dead Dad Jack. <laughs> he's got that look on his face already. This man's like, he's struggling. He's already, <laughs> <laughs> the room's already spinning. <laughs> Michael's going to need a smoke break. It didn't have a pump. Five pickles. God, he just keeps going. Wow. <laughs> Sorry, he is a, he is in a other, another universe right now. Just <laughs> just dizzy, <laughs> dizzy as can be. But he's 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 focused. He's concentrated. And now they're both going at it. Here we I go. Help. Yeah, I'll step on it. Wow. Yeah. There you go. Big help. Big help. God, how long is this scene going to go? It's just them out here wheezing. <laughs> yeah, that's going to be the rest of the episode. Oh, she got to take a break. Something that'll help us do this. Like electric pump or... Yeah, go in there. If you got an air compressor, that may help. Bicycle pump? Honey, I'm sorry to tell you this, but that's going to take a year just to blow that damn pool up. Go oh, get the air mattress. there's the pump that came with it right there. Oh. <laughs> there they go. All right. Yeah, golly. I can't, can't believe they asked him to go out there and blow this up by themselves. Good Lord. Right. I mean, they got enough shots of it, though. They had freaking four angles on just his face. Oh, that's a drink plug. <laughs> I was wondering, I was like, what's about to blow up? <laughs> the old drain plug, you know. Somebody <laughs> plug. I was wondering why my blow up would go up. <laughs> she was blowing on the drain plug the whole time. Oh my god. Oh my uh, gosh. It was a damn drain plug the whole time. I was literally blowing air down the drain. I can't believe they, wow. they made him sit there and blow that up the whole time just so they could set that joke up. Good Lord. Because you 100% you know they thought of that first. They didn't just go out there, well, I need to blow it up with my <laughs> mouth. No, no. Pretend this, these are not stage scenarios. They didn't blow up the top part. I splash you. <laughs> That's cold, by the way. That water yeah. coming out of that tap is cold. Oh, <laughs> this, it's got to be cold. This is about to be the coldest swim pool world. <laughs> But he's having fun though. Yay! Yeah. Clap, clap. <laughs> what? Oh, that looks just like Michael, man. <laughs> Same dude. Oh man. We got we got we got Layla. 
got Raph, we got Davy. They're all going to be like these like brown, like light, maybe dark blonde haired babies. Uh, but I think I think Mike is going to be uh, black hair and blue eyes. I think he's going to oh, be the yeah? one, the one, the one that may look like me. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody says that they look like me, but I, I don't know. I just can't. I guess I don't see myself enough. Right. Same and toast, Mike. I can see Simon it now. Toast Mike. Yeah. <laughs> yesterday, something really, really terrible happened. Oh, what happened yesterday? You had fun, baby. Something awful happened. They had to get the pond out, you know, get the little pool. What happened? Picked a little bit up from Granny's house. She crawled in the back seat with Gage and just fell over. And then Michael was like, she, oh. she can't breathe and tried to, like, wake her up a little bit. Dang. So old Granny was like, here you go, buddy. Get in the van. Badoop. Golly. Wow. And then they And then they tried to... <laughs> I'm not trying to laugh at it, but like, she's not breathing. Let me try to wake her up. Like, well, she's not breathing, man. <laughs> CPR. And that was it. A little bit, just passed away. God. Are we talk about the dog or the what? Did they say was this a person or the dog? A little bit. Oh my god! I thought she said granny. That's what I was no. like. <laughs> it's like your mom just put the kid in the car, and that's what I that, that's what I thought that's they said. What, I swear oh, to God, gotcha. uh, and that's why I was so confused. I was like, "Bruh, the CPR." Oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking. I was like, "I don't know dog CPR. I don't know what I would have oh, done." But <laughs> okay, my bad. I just misunderstood. Okay, uh, like I, yeah, I literally thought she said the grandma like put her, put him in the van and then just kind of like crawled in and fell over. You know, that's, that's what I thought. I was like, "Good <laughs> God!" <laughs> yeah, oh, but the dog, the dog died. Um, well, we knew, we knew the dog died. Just didn't know when. Okay, it was a long time to have a dog. A little bit lived twenty two years. Twenty two years. Twenty two. Yeah! That dog lived two long dog lives. Holy crap. Wow. I'm worried about telling Tammy because I'm so scared that Tammy will just give up on her weight loss because something bad happened. Mm, okay, that's what I can say. What is Tammy going to do? Freak out? Everybody's so scared to tell her anything. But yeah, it's because they don't want her to fall off the wagon because literally anything that right. happens She's causes that to any happen. Excuse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's a mama? Oh, there's a spider on me. No. Sorry. <laughs> we're having this touching moment about this horrible thing, and then <laughs> right back to cracking up. All right. That's about how that's how Layla acts when a, when a bug is near her. She's just like, ah! <laughs> I've never in my life had a sweet tooth. And I'm telling you right now, since the surgery, ain't nothing better than a good piece of cheesecake. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> <laughs> like bro that cheesecake though woo doggy <laughs> something's up alright let's call hey, the Chris, doctor up how are you guys I've measured myself and I've lost 20 yeah, inches yeah there we go that's amazing Chris congratulations well can they cannot get like a better tablet with these guys like why why is their quality always in like 480 but you know it's just so bad <laughs> I do I can't eat hot stuff no more but if that's all I had to give up is a bottle of hot sauce, no, no worries. You know what I'm saying? No more hot stuff. I guess. Yeah, I guess the scars on the entire stomach or something. Don't, don't, don't mesh. Mm. Mm. I don't like hot stuff anyway. Oh man, <laughs> dude, I love I some hot stuff. I swear. I mean, I have like normal dude tolerance to hot stuff, right? I can eat hotter. I just don't like the burn. You know, I just, it's not like an enjoyable thing. I'm like, mm, that's good. I don't like that. And Mary does a lot. Yeah. As, as long as it's got the flavor with it, I like it, you know? But. Yeah, 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 yeah. But it's like in comparison to her, I don't know, she did like a video one time eating like whatever that hottest pepper they had at one time and was like, oh, that's cool. And like just brushed it off like it wasn't anything. I'm just human. But the entire family on her side thinks that I just can't handle anything spicy. <laughs> wow. I'm just like, they're like, oh, it's, it's, it's a little Black spicy is about can. as hot as you go, huh? And, and I'm like, it's, it's fine <laughs> if it's spicy. Like, some stuff that Mary gets, like, I eat it, and, like, my nose is running, and, like, my eyes are watering. I'm like, God, this is too hot, you know? And then, like, <laughs> we get from the same restaurant, and it'll be something, like, the kid, like, my Mary will be like, it's not spicy, and she'll give it to the kids, and they'll be like, oh, it's hot. And I got like, Mary, Mary. I will be the gauge. I'll be the okay? judge of that. <laughs> yeah, I will let them know <laughs> something is uh, wrong with you. I don't know. What it is. Yeah, you, you just don't have nerve endings on your tongue or something. I don't know what it. <laughs> I'd like. She needs to do the chip challenge thing. 
No, she would just sit there and eat it. Like she, it's like I don't know if she's just able to turn paint off or or what it is, but she just it doesn't phase her hot stuff. It's, it's, it's not like, a whatever. poker face. It's not a poker face. I I've seen her eat peppers. You know, like, yeah, she's like mm, she's the yummy. real deal. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, maybe it's even like the burn is just like mm, like it's perceived as like a good thing. Where I'm over here like ah eh, don't yeah, like. Maybe it comes across as like flavor for her. You know, it's like ah that's got a good flavor. Yeah, maybe she's just, a, she's just she's got a superpower. To eat that hot stuff. Can you jump on a scale for me? Okay. I don't weigh myself at all. Oh, now they're playing the scary music. Hey, can you weigh yourself? Dun 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 dun. Mm. Come on! Before this call even happened, you had to make sure you had a scale that was part of the <laughs> pretend. God, dude, they got the old thermostat on the wall over here. Holy crap! Oh, golly. Mm. Yeah, I'd be I'd be concerned if it even works at that point. Yeah, I'm just kind of wondering what, on the wall. what these what these ducks look like if they're that old. Holy crap! Dang, two ninety nine. Let's that. go. Any day of the week. <laughs> under yeah, under three hundred. Half pound, baby. <laughs> Half pound, the champ. Did it. <laughs> nice. You probably have another fifty pounds or so to lose if you work really hard and being strict at your diet and your exercise. Hmm. Okay. All right. New goal, 50 more pounds. Not yet, sir. Can't cut it yet. Can't cut it yet. Yeah, well, I mean, because if you, if you get the skin removal surgery and then you lose more, more weight. Yeah, 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 yeah. Back to Tammy. What does she got going on? Oh, the bad news is coming. Uh-oh. Oh, oh no. And she's got her skull. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, my gosh. The foreshadowing. Yeah, it's like, by the way, oh, I like, like that, what you're wearing there, all those skulls and stuff. Yeah, by the way, the dog's dead. Yo. That little JBL speaker, though, that thing's booming, man. Oh, yeah, that yeah, little speaker back there. Yep, 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 you're yeah. right. You lost 50 pounds before, like it wasn't nothing. So you know you can lose 10 pounds. Yeah. It ain't nothing but a good, healthy <laughs> God. <laughs> yeah, you've been in the bath just go to the bathroom and just knock that right out. Easy. A good, healthy 10-pound poop. Good. <laughs> okay. Ain't nothing healthy about that. Ain't oh. one thing healthy about that. I don't know if this is the right time to tell Tammy about a little bit passing away, but I can't risk her hearing it from somebody else because she'll get pissed off, and I don't want to deal with that. So I guess there's no time like the present. I, you know, honestly, in the real world, outside the show, when the dog passed away, Tammy probably knew that day. Oh, yeah. Because someone texted her or something like, oh, I think a little bit, I think a little bit died. Oh, no. You know, something like that. That would have happened. It would have been like, well, I need to call her tomorrow and get her ready. And I'm worried. No, no she already knows. She already knows. 100%. Last night, a little bit passed away. I'm, I mean, I'm <laughs> heartbroken. I knew a little bit was getting old. The dog was 22 years old. Yeah, getting old. That dog was ancient. The dog been old. <laughs> For like 10 years. They still tell legends a little bit, <laughs> the other dogs. <laughs> like this one dog lived at 22 years old. Can you believe it? <laughs> Coming here, I never dreamed that she would pass away before I could get home. No, uh, so I wonder if that's going to become a thing, too. It's like, well, a little bit's passed away while I went in there. I got to get back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everybody come over and just hang out or something in memory of her name. So me and Michael are just... Well, now you're really rubbing it in. Where Everybody's going to come over in memory of, of a little bit, and you can't come, but uh, we'll call you, I guess. I know it's a little weird to have a service for a dog, but for me, it's important to... Like, I ain't have to apologize for having a service for a dog. It's fine. It's a very important part of your life. You have that dog for forever. Have a little service. It's all good. Do what you want to do. A little bit past the way is the hard, but... Losing that 10 pounds ain't gonna be nothing. There you go. Yeah, bring it back up. Wholesome, wholesome season. Wholesome season. Bam. That dog may be dead, but you can lose that 10 pounds. You're right. But I'm gonna you do ain't it. Dead, Tammy. I'm gonna do it for a little bit. <laughs> I'm gonna do it for her. Amy's having her second baby. Chris is losing weight. Amanda's getting divorced. Oh, Amanda's getting divorced. Throw that in there. Somebody's getting divorced. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> she, I thought that was old. Well, is it? I thought she, I thought when she talked about the divorce, it was like a while back. I don't even remember her talking about it. Huh. Been a long time coming, I guess. All this yeah. stuff is going on and I'm not there. Well, that is it. We'll watch top half the episode as we do. Maybe we'll get claimed because I always tell them that it's transformative. We try to, people always say, why do you stop this stuff so much? 
just so that we don't get copyright. We gotta make it. We gotta make it into something new. We gotta make it into something new. So uh, we've accomplished that today. Anyway, leave a like, leave a comment. Leave what you think. Today's your birthday. Happy birthday. Touch my friends. Love you. See you next time. Bye bye. Bye, pickles. <laughs>